In this tutorial, we will create steps for terrace. So here now, here this height is 0.6, wall height is 3 meter and slab height is 0.15. That means total is 3.75. So 3.75 by 0.15. So it will come to 25. So 13 and 12 steps we want to make it. So first we will see what is the plane on which we want to make it, uh, create the steps. So for that we will click on this AC isometric. So when in AC isometric this surface is front. So we will choose the front plane. Front. Then we will go in empty space. And suppose we will make the steps layer is already current. So we will just create 13 steps suppose take line command give the first point take your cursor in the line of y direction and give the height of 0.15 zoom it then in the x direction give 0 0.23 0 0.15 0 0.23 enter enter then copy it copy select object enter give Take the bottom endpoint and put it on the top endpoint. Make ortho on F8. Click. So, 6, 8, 10, 12. And we want one more. So, we will again copy it. Copy. Select object. Enter. Take this point to this point. Escape to come out. Then connect this by line command again. Line. Click on the bottom endpoint to top endpoint, escape to come out, then offset it, offset by 0 0.05 mm, click outside, escape, then erase, E enter, select the internal line, enter, then draw a horizontal line from here, line, take this endpoint, take it outside, make it straight, escape, enter, again line, Click the endpoint, create it vertical, enter. Then press pull this, press pull. Click, give the length of 1 meter, escape. So 13 has been created. 13. Then I don't want this line, so I will erase it. Here is these two lines enter then there will be a landing so landing will be of 1 meter length so we will create one rectangle here rectangle give the first point take the dimension option so length is 1 and thickness will be from this point to this point and give the side click then press pull it and give the length of 2 escape to come out then move it move select object enter take this endpoint and connect it to this endpoint here is this rectangle enter then I want 12 in this direction so I will just copy this or I can mirror this also to create it opposite so I will choose mirror 3D, select object, enter, then I have to give three points around which I want to mirror. So around this surface I want to mirror, so I will take the three point of this surface, this first point, second point and third point. And delete source object, no, escape. So I don't want one step below, I want 12 only, so I will draw a line here, line, L enter, take the end point make ortho on f8 click escape and then press pull this to cut it press pull select object go outside and click press escape to come out now move this select object enter take this endpoint and put it here at this endpoint or midpoint so in this way delete so this steps has been created then one meter landing will be needed so for that 
again we will we can actually press pull this portion press pull select object and give the length of 1 meter escape to come out so landing is also ready so in this way these steps are created so move these steps move select object so this top enter take this top point as a base point that we will put it at the make orthon f8 we will align it with at the mid of this slab slab point slab midpoint so it has been properly placed and those are not coming down that means they are exactly matching so those are properly placed then we will have to create railing here we will need the railings So for that we will create suppose one circle again circle so for that we will need a top plane so we will escape and from here select the top plane because we want to press pull vertical circle give the center point give the radius of point 0 to 20 mm zoom it and press pull it press pull It is not pre spilling so extrude it, select object, enter, give the height of 0.75, escape to come out. Then move it or copy it, copy, select object, enter, take this quadrant, click and copy it here at the mid of this midpoint. At alternate steps, you have to copy it pan and copy ok here we will go for this midpoint then we will go for this endpoint and again this midpoint so here it will not be needed escape now here it, ha it has gone outside so we can move it so we will just make this ground layer off so that we can work properly then choose move select object enter base point give the direction make orthon f8 so we, we will be going inside by radius so 0 0.02 so now these are properly placed so we will copy in between also so copy select object enter give the base point give the direction inside distance will be 0.5 and 1.5 press escape so those are properly copied and this is also very away so we will just move it move select object enter base point second point just put it properly escape so this side are created then we can copy this to this side also so just copy select all of them then enter now I actually I will have to select this this quadrant and I will have to put at the mid of this so those will align properly so this side is done then next will be here so for that again we will copy this copy select object enter take this side of quadrant and copy it here make ortho of f8 copy at alternate positions midpoint midpoint again this midpoint then this endpoint this midpoint escape so again these are gone outside so we can move it inside move select object enter base point 
make orthon f it give 0 0.02 as a distance escape to come out so those are properly placed then we have to to create a pipe passing through all this point we will use 3d polyline command 3d polyline connect the center make ortho of center point this last then inside make ortho on f8 so we want to go inside by distance of 0 0.5 escape so it will touch properly then to convert it into a pipe take the circle command give the center point give this uh, radius of 0 0.02 then to convert this line and circle into 3d object use sweep command sweep select object enter click on this line so in this way this pipe is created same way we can create on this side also 3d polyline select the center again this center center and this last center last center and again here inside I want to go by 0.5 escape so again circle 0 0.02 then sweep this circle enter this line click on this line so in this way railing is ready then I will need a opening for here entry for entry so for that suppose I will create one line line from this end point and take it outside so when it shows object snaps don't take those object snap you can take it in empty space enter ok here actually we made a mistake actually we was have to connect it from here to here so that care you have to take then again line command from this point to this point enter then press pull it press pull select inside go there give the thickness of 0 0.3 escape then erase this e enter select the object enter so in this way the steps and railing has been created so we will stop here thank you and we will make this ground layer on